Hi, it's Mike. It's Tuesday. I hope that you were on and watching and listening to our short messages the last couple of weeks. As I said to you last Tuesday, we're going to be doing this for an extended period of time. Fortunately, our response to these have been very positive in the first week. We hope that continues because my job is to deliver each week for you a couple times a week, Tuesday and Thursday, a message that is designed to force you to think about the business of listing and selling real estate, to get you involved in the activities that bring you listings and sales, and to keep you deeply involved in common sense, which as you know in this business is certainly very uncommon. Several weeks ago I had the good fortune of spending two weeks in Toronto and we did two back-to-back -back four day workshops. I started each of those four day workshops by writing seven words up on the whiteboard and I said I want to capsulize for you in five minutes or less the real estate business and I want to share with you what I said to them and I want you to think about each of these seven words in relationship to you. Who you are, what you stand for, what your values are, what you believe in, and what you're going to do. Because these seven words will summarize, in pretty most, most cases, your real estate career. I said, first of all, we're in the people business. We're in the business of dealing with, talking to, communicating with, being involved with people. And as I said to you last Tuesday, if you're not the kind of person who likes talking to people, this is a hard business. Our job is to be able to understand people, to be able to deal with people, to be able to evaluate people, to be able to ask questions of people. Our job revolves around people. Now, you know, 10, 15 years ago, people said, you know, real estate people won't be needed any longer. It's going to be a business all done on the Internet, on the web, by computer. Interesting how far off they were, weren't they? Because the truth is, yes, we know that buyers search for properties on the Internet. We know that, and we know that, unfortunately, most agents spend all day on the Internet. Sad but true. But the truth is, the people are buying and selling real estate through people. The second word is the word image. What image do you present to the public? Think about the image, because people criticize, people condemn, com people complain about, people are very, very, very tough in how they see people today. They want a professional image, they want a professional salesperson. Do you present the image? And then I wrote down the word communication. We're in the communication business. Communication, how well do you speak? How well do you talk? Are you understood? Are you willing to ask questions? Are you willing to listen to answers when they give them to you? Because we are in the people, image, and communication business. And then I wrote down forth for them the word service. We're always going to be paid in direct correlation to the amount of service we extend and offer and the quality of that service. Is your service as good as you think it is? The answer is, are the buyers and sellers accepting your service in high volume? And then I wrote down the word mindset, because unfortunately so much of what we do depends on what's going on in here. What's going on in here determines what comes out of here. If our mindset is strong and it's positive and we're excited about what we do, that shows in everything that we do. And then I talked about the word skills, because selling is a skill business. It's a skill business. If we have great skills, we can sell a lot. And then the last word I wrote on the board for these two groups was the word action. Are you willing to consistently, four to five to six to seven hours a day, take the actions required to become a great salesperson and do 25, 40, 60, 80, 100 transactions a year? You're talking, excuse me, you're listening to the guy that has coached more people in that volume of business than anybody in the history of this business. If you want to do a lot of business, you're talking to the right guy. Some of you are inquiring about the Superstar Retreat coming up in July. Four words that I'm going to spend four days on. Production, I'm going to give you 75 to 80 deals on how to increase production. Skills, 75 to 80 deals on how to improve your skills. Profit, 75 to 80 ideas on how to make sure that you're profitable and making a lot of money. And mindset, 75 to 80 good ideas on mindset. If you want to have the best four days of your life, or should I say to you, the next set of best four days of your life, boy, join us at the retreat in July. In either case, I'll look forward to seeing you and talking to you next Thursday. Thanks for today.